What's up, guys? Clip beats, no script, off the rip. We're jumping into some Adam Calhoun, uh, Shook Ones remix. Damn, it's a classic right there. Um, guys, I know I'm a little bit late. I apologize. I'm doing this right now at 3.30 in the morning. Hopefully, I can get to see you by the end of the day. Uh, really a day late, so go like, go subscribe. Show love to Adam Calhoun. Oh, shiza. Show love to Adam Calhoun, and let's see what this is about. People kept messaging me. Don't spoil stuff. When people message me, I'll, I'll hear someone start saying it's about, and then I instantly stop reading. Don't tell me what stuff is about. I like to find out on my own, man. And ACAL has got, man, I think, I don't know what happened, but over the last, like, two or three years, I feel like ACAL has really been pushing this pen, like, fully focused, and it's been insane what he's done. So, let's see what he's working with. Like, subscribe, show up to the original artist. Let's go. Sycamore Street. He said, I'm at the corner of a sycamore. Or I'm a sycamore. Getting copyright strike to shit. Keep this subliminal to minimal when you belittle me. Say my name in the disc. Be a man, die with dignity. I picked up the pen again so you can start hating. Everything I drop does numbers. Smart Asian. Albums chart. <laughs> Everything I do does numbers. A smart Asian. He said, yo, no more subliminals. If you want to diss me, then fucking diss me. Go out like a man. I like that. And again, so you can start hating. Everything I drop does numbers. Smart Asian. Albums chart high as fuck. Part you're making. Thought fast, white boy. Stand in ovation. Rappers suck dick. You think they trying to put their throat on. Do everything to make it. Except write a dope song. I fly pressure. He ain't breathing. Need a CPAP. My beard's so long. It's hanging out the ski mask. I wish Eminem would be back. He used to be dope. Like a weed bag. Take a stand next and have a relapse. I lose myself in the beat. Flipping through my CDs. Big and eyes. They was always on repeat. Now Lil Nas X sucking dick on the TV. And kids watching that shit. Freely. And you think... Ooh, I like how we did a little segue. So free Lee. So he, he added free Lee to connect everything beforehand. That was nasty. But yeah, he's saying how, look, all these other MCs used to be so dope. I used to keep Nas and, uh, did he say Big L? He, 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 huh, what did he say? He used to be dope like a weed bag. So he said, yeah, Eminem used to be dope. So yeah, right now, you know, Eminem, people feel a different type of way. You know, he's saying, go ahead and relapse and lose yourself. Obviously, popular lose yourself track. Take a stand next and have a relapse. I lose myself in the beat, flipping through my CDs. Big and Nas, they was always on repeat. Big and Nas, they was always on repeat. For me, it was Big L. Like, Big L, dude, when, when Big L dropped, Nas heard Big L and was like, dude, this is what the fuck I'm up against? I'm fucked. It's literally what he said. He goes, I'm fucked. Yeah, Nas, Big L, Big that's where I was at too. Now Lil Nas X sucking dick on the TV and kids watching that shit. Free Lee. And you think this that eight mile beat, this that mob deep black jungle concrete beat handled on street freestyle came from your dome piece and I was out there chasing dreams with my homies. I like how he said that too. This ain't from eight mile, bro. You got to go back and study hip hop. People, and this happening a lot right now. Sorry to stop from the middle of the reaction, boss, but I got to explain a little bit of hip hop. People will hear beats today and they don't realize that it's all recycled beats from some of the greatest that have ever done it. Pioneers of hip hop. It drives me nuts. This, that. Even lines. Like, they'll take lines and recycle them. And people will be like, oh, that's dope. This person said, it's like, that's from somebody else, bro. Eight mile beat. This, that mob deep black jungle concrete beat. Handled on street freestyle came from your dome piece. And I was out there chasing dreams with my homies. PTSD from shackle feet. The whole hood buzzing like I'm giving out crack for free. White Ooh. boys for my shit because I actually got roots in this bitch like a massive tree. Everything you drop miss like Shaq from three. And you just bark a lot but wouldn't smack a flea. People say it's chess, not checkers. They can't play chess. I'll teach you how to win, move more, say less. I've been a rapper, always be a rapper. You can never battle me because you can smack for trying to be a fucking rapper. I started from the bottom like the number in the fraction. And you just steady talking. I don't never see no Action. Started like about started from the bottom like a number in the fraction in a fraction. Um, you play chess dog? What openings you like? Middle game? End game? Come on, let's go. And a rapper. What's your rating? I'll always be a rapper. You can never battle me because you get smacked for trying to be a fucking rapper. I started from the bottom like the number in the fraction. And you just steady talking. I'll never see no action. You ain't cut the same. I can tell by your outfit. And you don't pose a threat. I stepped in bigger mouth shit. Peter Piper picked the wrong pecker with the play with the pecker. But wordplay. Put respect Ooh. on my name, bitch. Peter Piper. 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 Peter Piper
Peter Piper picked him with impeccable pep. What do you say? Impeccable what? Did you say with an impeccable pecker? Tell by your outfit and you don't pose a threat. I stepped in bigger mouth shit. Peter Piper. Yeah, you don't pose a threat. I stepped in bigger mouth shit. A rat. A rat. And I've been, he said, I've been through worse shit. This is nothing. If I picked the wrong pecker, would you play with? Yeah, it, Peter picked the wrong pecker to play with. Impeccable wordplay. With impeccable wordplay, okay. Respect on my name, bitch. Get ran through like a train, bitch. I can leave the day, but you'll always be the same, bitch. Let it rain, I ain't talking about umbrellas. You're ready for the rain, bitch. I'm talking about forever. For better, for worse, I never this verse. Go get in a hearse and kill yourself. Self, self, self. For better, for worse, I never this verse. Go get in a hearse and kill yourself. Self, self, self. All right, now there's a reason why it's putting that there, and I don't know why. I'm missing something. This is directed at somebody in particular, and I, it's flying over my head. I apologize. It's the first thing I do as soon as I wake up is I get to watch this man rap at his driveway, and he's spitting some absolute flames over an absolute iconic beat that I'm getting copyrighted for. For better, for worse, I never this first go get in a hearse and kill yourself. Self, self, self. This ain't a diss track, I ain't even trying. You'd rather see me and Ryan kill each other like a pack of lions. Cause y'all just a circus, bunch of serpents. You'd rather see me lying. Me lying. I like that right there. So he, he just said, he's, okay, then he's not dissing somebody. This is not a diss track. But he says something about in the beginning about, like, don't be setting subliminals. Get ready, you know, if you're going to go out, go out on your own shield. Maybe he's just meaning in general. For anybody who's out. If you're I think maybe he's saying, if you're going to diss somebody in general, then just go out dissing somebody fuck the subliminals i thought i i didn't say this was at ryan i didn't think it was at ryan but now he just mentioned it this track i ain't even trying you'd rather see me and ryan kill each other like a pack of lions yeah you'd rather see me and ryan up church kill each other like a pack of lions they're boys dude i know they they had a little bit of beast and shit but right now whatever is going on i don't know i stay out of it but he's saying like that's the circus you guys wanting to see that shit i know but i don't want to see that shit Y'all just a circus, bunch of serpents. You rather see me lying, me lying. That's a triple. Go back and listen. And I ain't going back to prison. I woke up this morning, prayed to God and kiss my daughter. Another day of living. I'm fucking living. Some motherfuckers will never understand rap. Even if I hand it to you, wrote it down and ran it to you. What you gonna do if I actually ran it to you? Same dude talking shit, get smacked and then sue you. Don't make me paint the town red like Subaru. I don't stretch the truth for views like you do. A couple bitch ass reactors. I like to see a list of your top 10 rappers. If I'm on that shit. <laughs> I'm laughing. There's one white dude and the rest are black men. Y'all have been a rap, but we all been wrecking shit. Got a couple spots in that list like a freckle bitch. Chef's kiss. I never thought I'd live to see the day Chris Rock got smacked by Fresh Prince. I can only hate one man. Yes, sir. And I'd leave him leaking on the street. Freshman red shirt. Freshman red shirt. Ho, ho, ho. See, I don't know. Damn it. I don't know enough about reactors, dude. I don't watch other reaction channels. Fuck. I didn't even know there was a damn community when I started this shit. Rap, but we all been wrecking shit. Got a couple spots in that list like a freckled bitch. Chef's kiss. So Chef's kiss, freckled bitch. I never thought I'd live to see the day Chris Rock got smacked by Fresh Prince. I can only hate one man. Yes, sir. And I leave him leaking on the street. Freshman, red shirt. And it ain't Ryan Edward. Motherfuckers run their mouth so much shit makes my head hurt. Alright, I need a breakdown. Someone give, <laughs> I'm supposed to be doing the breakdowns, but I need to, here's the thing, is at the end, I feel like he's talking to reactors and art, some certain artists, and I don't know who, I don't know who, again, I haven't kept up with the beef, my bad, people get on me like, well, do your fucking research, it's your job, no, it's not, I'm here to react, bro, I don't fucking sit here and study everyone's shit, I'm a real raw reaction channel, I like to point out bars, I like to enjoy the music with you and hang out, um, Again, I know a little bit about what happened, but now when he starts making references towards other reaction channels, I don't know them. I'm friends with some of them. Like, I, I, I work with some of them to help push artists' music, but I don't, like, watch their content. So I, like, I didn't know, like, uh, with Stevie, you now like, ho hose our uh, headaches. I didn't know that. So when I did, like, an easy mill breakdown... I didn't know that that's what he was referencing at all. So when, when he said that, I was like, why are you, well, I didn't know what he was saying. I was like, what was I, I was like, what was he saying? 
I didn't know what he was saying. Then I found out it was hose our headaches. I didn't know that. Now I talk to Stevie. But I didn't know that beforehand. Mm. So if you guys can give me a little bit of a rundown down below. Because he even said, like, look, I, I could already pick up on it that there's layers here that I'm missing. There's cadences that he's putting in here on purpose to reference something else. You said no subliminals, but you threw some subliminals, damn it. You're playing chess. The London, damn it. No, I'm just kidding. Good shit, man. It, it was it was a nasty uh it was a nasty verse. It was a nasty verse. I'll, I'll give him that. I would I would call this a freestyle because I mean even though it was written, I'd still call it a freestyle because you took Shook One's remix and there was no fucking chorus or anything. You just went straight through for three minutes. Give it up to AKL, man. I've been saying this. His pen's been getting even better and better. At one point, he said he was going to retire, and I was like, do not do that. I was like, do not. Like, you're getting better and better, bro. Um, I think we all kind of have that moment, though. I've had it a few times where we're just like, oh, I'm done. I can't keep doing this shit. But he brought up valid points, too, with, like, little Nas X and the way the industry is going. And Oh, dude. Like, there was a point where Drake was using recycled lines from lyric, like from lyricists. And lyricists started getting so pissed off that Drake wasn't giving, paying him homage. So Drake would have to go and post on Instagram, like, you'd have to post the song and then show, like, a snippet of the original. I don't know if you guys knew that or not. But Drake was catching flack because he was not paying homage. He would take someone else's lyrics or beats and pay for them, right? But you still want to give a little nod. You know what I'm saying? So, like... When he did the Chicago freestyle, for example, he did the Monday through Sunday, yo, you know, from Eminem Superman shit. All of a sudden, he started posting, like, Eminem action figures and shit on his Instagram. Like, to let people know, like, hey, like, this is coming from M. And he was playing that portion of the song, like, in the video. You see what I'm saying? Like, you got to be careful with these new age rappers, man. That They will steal shit. And I like that a Akel called that out himself. He said, yo, this isn't from 8 Mile, bro. Do your research on hip-hop. Study hip hop. Don't just focus. If you, you don't just focus on one artist, he's saying like, look, yeah, Eminem killed it, but it wasn't just Eminem for me, bro. I listened to everybody in the game. It was Nas and Big that M got in rotation too. I'm sure he's. And he also mentioned mentioned Wu Tang Clan. So yeah, I'm sure he studied everybody in hip hop. Just like anybody who loves hip hop, you don't just listen to one artist. You listen to everybody. It's, it's it's what is required to be an elite MC. You can't just study one artist to become an elite an elite MC. It's not possible. Anyways, enough of me rambling. What do you guys think of the track? Someone give me a rundown. What is happening? Who is he dissing? But he even said right here, like, yo, this isn't this isn't at Ryan. And you would like to see me and Ryan basically tearing apart each other like lions. That's what you'd want. But I'm not going to entertain the fucking circus of you clowns. Because people get views off it. People get views off beefs. Ugh. That was hard as fuck. The freshman line. Someone comment down below. Let me know what that's about. Because I'm missing that one right over my head. I'm sorry. Maybe I need to wake up more and revisit it. But I'm, I'm keeping it a buck. I won't lie to you during my reactions, bro. If I miss something, I miss something. You know what's going to happen is I'll probably go listen to this again when I'm driving in the studio here in a couple hours. And I'll listen to it again. And I'll be like, motherfucker. And then someone's going to comment like, you don't know what you're talking about. This is what it meant. I'm like, fuck. You're right. I didn't in that moment. It's all right, man. You you, you got a top tier lyricist here going at it. It's going to happen. You know how many times I, re I had to rewind Nas? I had to rewind Big. I had to rewind M. I had to rewind Pun. Like, that's just a part of hip hop. Gives it more spins. Back in the day, you couldn't rewind like you did, can today. You had to fucking <laughs> the whole tape. You had to bring back, baby. I love you guys. Be safe. Follow me to the next one. Um, show love to Akel, Adam Calhoun. Go like, go subscribe. Um, his channel is it's his, his channel though is uh, Adam Calhoun. So A D A M space C A L H O U N. I will link everything down below. Show love to the original artist. That's what I'm here for. Show love to the original artist, man. If you ever need me, reach out. All my socials are linked down below. I wouldn't be here without you guys. So thank you so much for everything. All right.
This was my cup of coffee in the morning. I'm waking my ass up. Be safe, everybody. I love you.